Hi, it's me again with Corel Draw Tips and Tricks, and somebody emailed me this this graphic right here, and they're I'm pretty proud of them. They're trying to use the clone tool, and if you look, this is a well. Let's pick it with the pick tool. This is a control curve, which means they cloned it, and they're trying to make a river like run through this item. I don't know what it is, and if you you know if you take your shape tool, and if you move one of these, it moves the other clone out. Like if we move this over here, it it's doing just the opposite. It's cloning that. And you could spend a lot of time. They're trying to get it evenly spaced through there. Well, all I did was take their graphic and use a smart fill tool and fill that in. And then I'll left click, right click, control D and make a duplicate and then rotate it both ways and just kind of made their shape uh, pretty close to their shape and then welded it got their shape and then uh, had to make curve apart take out that inside but anyway I've got one here and I've already done one and I'm not the best drawer with the freehand tool but now with the new smooth tool it's still if we take the freehand tool and start about there whoop I don't like that at all start like that and kind of do a sweep and then end up on there and then before you do anything else, take the smoothing tool and you're only gonna be smoothing out that line. Now take this line and double click on your thickness of your line. And let's try 10 points again. And it didn't work. So why did it not work? I must not have had it clicked. Yep, you can see in the background it did it. Then go up to object and break or convert outline to an object. And then that left click and right click and you see we have a river run through it. Now just select them all and it's either going to be back minus front or front minus back. And it was uh, front minus back or the light. I can't remember. Um, it was back minus front and it took that away. Now we have a river running through this, what they called it. And it's perfect. It's the same distance on both sides. You could, with the clone tool, you could spend a, a week in trying to get it perfect if you wanted it perfect. So just use your outline tool and then make your, or use your pen tool and then use it to outline the thickness of the line as an outline. And it'll be equal all the way through. I hope that helped them a little bit, and thank you for watching.